Hello, Yay! everyone. Hello. Yay! Hi, this is Dr. Rose and my friend Maddie. Uh, Hi, how's guys. everyone doing? Hi, everybody. Yeah. All right. So here we have, let's see who's number one. On Common Sense is number one. Uh, and then uh, Dylan, uh, Zoe, Marilyn Cape Hart, Estella is here. Uh, who? Six Rock and Robin is here. Michelle. Oh, and, and we already got money already. Wow. <laughs> Dr. Rose, sister, you are the greatest. You are uh, a giving person when you give me. When you give, you give with all your heart. Thank you, thank you, and thank. Oh my God, Chaplain was what made my day today. Uh, who else do we have? Uh, Todd Evelyn. We have uh, Marilyn. Uh, Nina Wright. Perfumes with Pat. Janice. Jesse Wasso. Thank you, Jesse, for being here. Lumi Sir. Nadia. Uh, Catherine. Catherine is here. Hey, mom. Hey, <laughs> hey, Catherine, how are you? Michelle Simpson. Oh my God, Michelle, welcome back. Michelle. Bye, Michelle. Thank you for joining us. Been here for a while. I'm so happy that you're here, Michelle. We appreciate it. Joanne, my one of my uh, you know uh, uh, supporters. Joanne is always here with us. Thank you, and, Joanne. You know, Lumisa is here. Lumisa is here. She's always here with us. Uh, oh my God, Belinda! We have a lot, we have eighteen people here, so let's take this show on the road. Let's do it. <laughs> let's do this. Let's go. Uh, and we, we also have Todd Evening. That's my sister. Oh, my my sister. Oh my God! So we have the whole here. Hi, I know. Can, can you guys hear us? Okay. Sometimes I know. Okay. Yeah, can you see? Uh, Someone got the sewing heaven. Yes. So, Maddie, tell, tell us about your sewing. Tell us about what you do with your sewing. Well, I have a passion for sewing uh, all things <laughs> from clothing to quilt to um, dolls. I make dolls. Mm. Here's Frida. Let's see, Frida. There's Frida. Um, anyway. Okay. But uh, I do a lot of embroidery, so you can see some of my thread rolls. Uh, it continues on this wall all the way that wall, and I just love it. So I thought instead of perfume background, we'd do a thread background tonight. <laughs> so uh, not to put you on the spot, how many uh, sewing machines are you on? Ten. Oh, my God. But wow. that's two embroideries some sewing machines, a serger, like, you know, different stuff. <laughs> oh, wow. This, uh, oh, and Pam is here. Hi, Welcome, Nina. Pam. Thank you, Pam. Thank you, Pam. Thank you for being here tonight. Hi, Nina. I'm glad you like Frida. Yeah, so tonight we're going to talk about, uh, so wait, wait. Uh, he said I have one machine and one serger. Wow. Oh. We could sell it. Yeah, yeah. We should get down. <laughs> yeah. And can, can, uh, oh, hey, Maddie, there's a comment. I was thinking about it, but that was Halloween. Rose was like, you can't wear your Halloween hat again. So. <laughs> yeah. So the hat had to go, right? The hat had to go. Oh, my God. My really, I'm so sorry. sorry. Okay. So no, uh, can you, you guys can hear us? Okay. Is the volume okay? Because I, I turned down my volume a little bit because it was a little bit too loud the last time I, I did la I did a live. So I want to make sure that, you know, I'm not blind. I mean, people are not get, going deaf with, you know, with my high-pitched voice. So please let me know if you, the sound is okay if I need to raise it up a little bit. Hi, Christy. Hey, Christy. Christy. <laughs> <laughs> let me know if I'm too loud. I'll stop yelling. Thank I, think, you. I, think, I can hear you fine, Maddie. Okay. All right. So tonight is about yummy fragrance. So before we start, uh, I need to uh, uh, tell the group something. You guys, my last live I did, okay, the last live I did uh, was about my uh, uh, perfumes. What do you call that? My uh, uh, it was part two of my entire perfume collection. Mm -hmm. And uh, you guys who actually ended up with the with the testers, 
I have not sent them out. The only reason why I've not sent them out is because I'm going to do part three, uh, maybe on, either on Saturday or Sunday. And I want to wait because I know the same people are end up going to win again. So instead of sending that one little one little tester out, right? Instead of sending one little tester out, so I decided I'm gonna wait and send maybe two or three of them together just to save money on you know on, on shipping and also having to print all these uh, uh names and, and addresses and you know stop these envelopes. So I decided I'm just gonna wait and then maybe send two or three after I do maybe two or three shows together, two or three shows and then just send all of them together to the people who actually want them. So this is why I haven't sent them out. So uh, give me for that stock in the US Postal Service because she ships so much good stuff to you guys. <laughs> yeah. 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 So I'm just gonna wait and then I will just pack it, you know, yeah, I'm just gonna package all of it in in the same, you know, same uh, package and send them out. But the other people that I owe other things aside from this, right? Uh you know, they uh, actually they they got they should they should it should be on the way or they maybe the uh they've already received them. Ooh. All right. So uh, Thanks for coming tonight. I think, Maddie, you should be able to pull the comments into your screen, too. Oh, I can? Uh-huh, yeah. Revolutionary. Just, oh, wait. Click on it. Yes. Hold on. Betty just said hi to me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I've got the power now. Yeah. Sorry, guys. There's a learning curve for me. <laughs> oh, it's all right. It's all right. So uh, how do you guys like my eye, my eyeshadow today? I did, I did eyeshadow makeup. Can you guys see it? Yeah, I did my own. I did eyeshadow. I did too, but my eyes were running. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. So, all right. So let's let's get this show on the road. We have thirty people here. This is a really good turnout. All right. Yummy fragrances. Do you want to start first, Maddie? How many fragrances do you have to show today? Well, I brought out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I brought out ten, but some of them are the same. Uh. So. Uh. Joanne asked, is asking Maddie, what is your YouTube channel? And Joanne, unfortunately, Maddie doesn't have a YouTube channel. She yes. decided to do this with me because she's a really good friend of mine. But she, she you know, I, I've been asking her to do a YouTube channel, but she doesn't want to do it. No. Yeah, I think you'll be no. good at it, Maddie. I think you'll be excellent at a YouTube channel. I just like to support Dr. Rose. So I make pop up appearances once in a while, and uh, <laughs> that's enough yeah. for me. <laughs> You definitely have enough fragrances to do a YouTube channel. You know. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> hey, hey uh, Raj Kumari Singh. Uh, thank you for being here. Thank you for coming, Raj. It's yes, chilly. Are oh, one more. Hey, unique. All right. So how many perfumes do you have, girlfriend, to show today? Um. Probably, well, what should I start out with? Where do we want to start? No, how, ma how many total do you have? Well, I brought in 10. Two are the same. Okay. So uh, I thought we'd talk about, what, eight? Is that good? Eight. Is that and, I, and the first person, you know, we always do the first person who joined the live gets uh, a decade of something. So the first person was Uncommon Sense. Uncommon Sense will get a decade of a perfume. Or if you want to donate to somebody, you can donate, donate it to the second person, which is, you know, Gulen. Uh, or whomever you want in the in, in the chat, you can donate it to whomever you want, or you can keep it. All right. Okay, so... Uh, I, I have to remember that Uncommon Sense was the, the winner for the night. But I also have a, have a giveaway that I'm going to give out. I'm going to give a full bottle of perfume tonight. You know, as you can see, the red tonight is, the team is red tonight. So the full bottle of perfume you guys are going to get is going to be a red bottle, a perfume in a red bottle. It's a beautiful amber perfume. Should I, should we discuss the new red bottle at all or no? Oh, yeah. Well, you want to discuss your new red bottle? Go for it. Or okay. Do you are you going to discuss yours? No, uh, -uh no, 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 no. <laughs> uh -uh, don't put me on the, uh, on the, on the, on, on, on the spot. No. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. I'll back off. Well, then I will discuss mine. Yeah. Um, Maddie, there's a question for you. Yes. What? How many total fragrances is what? <laughs> for, today. for today or forever? Oh, my God. This was too much. Oh, my much. God. Um, Yes, yes, Uncommon Sense knows of my red bottle. Um, so let me pull them out. This one is the controversial one that Rose does not like. Let's see. So it's I like it. <laughs> <laughs> It's Christian Louboutin's Louboutin's And I love the crocodile on it. 
she's got little spikes. And let's see if we can get around to her little painted toenails. Oh, look, let's see. I, I can't focus on them, but she's got little red toenails. I'm such a bad <laughs> cinematographer. So first of all, this cap is super heavy and it's beautiful. It and it like comes it. with a travel cap. Now, this is a, supposed to be an oriental uh, spicy fragrance. I've got to pull up my notes. It's called Luby Croc. <laughs> what a crack. It's um, part of the, oh, thank you, Saperonzo, again. Um, yeah. <laughs> it is an intricate bottle, and it, I think it's beautiful. I love the uh, crocodile. Not everybody does, and that's fine. I, In this I, case, it's supposed to be like keeper of the pyramid secrets. Which I think is really cool. Like, it's not just a Bayou Creeper. You know, it's got meaning. Yeah. And so in this line, there are seven. And um, Luby World is what it's called. And the other one I got. Oh, there are seven? It's seven there of them? There are seven of them. So, okay. Well, do you want to what, do you want to talk to about them throughout the, throughout the night? Or are you going to talk all, about all three of them at once? We'll talk about them throughout the night. Yeah. So, First, this one, the Luby Croc is um, woody, amber, spicy, um, balsamic, powdery, aromatic, but it wasn't what I was expecting at all. Um, it wasn't? Okay. It's, well, it's funny because when I first sprayed it, it I got sweet and light and something kind of airy, but now that I'm just sniffing the bottle... <laughs> Um, I'm smelling a little more patchouli and a little more powder, but I think this, so that's probably the dry down, but the initial spray is kind of on the sweeter end and something you might wear during the day. I don't know. That was my first uh, response to the Luby Croc, but okay. um, next Dr. Rose can talk about something. Uh, well, do you like the perfume? Um, I like it. I wouldn't wear it. <laughs> but you wouldn't. Okay. But, but, but it's, it's but, an expensive perfume. It's an expensive perfume. It's an expensive perfume. It's um, I think for what it is, it's very expensive. And I love the bottle. I don't love the perfume as much as it is. And I was like, um, were you hoping for more? No, I'm just I'm difficult wearer. I mean, it's a uh, Louboutin, Christian Louboutin, and it's the Louby World Collection. There's seven of them. Uh, so I, thought, I thought there were only six. No, there are seven. It's, let me okay. pull them up real quick. There's Louby Do, which has a cat on it, and we'll talk about that later. There's Louby Croc, which has the crocodile. There's Louby Crown, which has a crown. There's uh, Luby Kiss, which has like I think a Day of the Dead skull with a flowers like a kiss face. Um, let's see, Luby Funk has a pineapple on top. Um, uh -huh. Luby Raj has like a panther. How many is that? Is that all of the? Oh, and then Luby one more. Uh, Luby Mess is there. Luby Mess What? Luby Mess. Luby Mess. Yes, we'll be nuts for sure. <laughs> we'll be crap. Okay, so um, but anyway, what happened? Don't I mean, you know, know, what did I just say? because a, you know, and I always tell people this: just because a perfume is expensive, does not mean that you know people are going to immediately love it. Yeah, and and here's yeah. the truth, guys. I'm a finicky, finicky perfume wearer. I don't love everything, and so for me, often it is about the bottle. And even if I love a perfume, I can't always wear it. So I'm good at picking up the notes. I'm good at picking up what's in a fragrance. But just because I love it doesn't always mean I can wear it, unfortunately, because okay. I get hungry. So that's okay. my deepest secret. So I'm getting so, so many compliments on that on my Thank you, guys. It's Luby World. Uh, Luby, Luby Kiss, I'm sorry. Luby Kiss? No, hold on and tell you garbage. Hold on. Luby Rouge has the stiletto. Okay. Luby Rouge. All right. So, all right, I'm next, right? Yes. So I have, let me see. One, two, three, four, five, 
six seven perfumes and probably maybe a little bit extra on, on the table here that i want to talk about how many do you uh, have uh seven how many do you have? i have a few more okay uh so i you know the first one is is the perfume that you know everybody i think everybody who has come in, in contact in touch with this perfume they really they really love it and this is uh this perfume is in my top 30. my because i have top top five top 10 top 15 top, top 20 top 25 top 30. so this one is in my top 30 perfumes it's uh Mancera roses vanille and you know for those of you guys who do not have uh roses vanille I would say to maybe you know to uh maybe get your hand on it because it's such a beautiful perfume and you know the season to wear it is coming up you know the summer uh, i mean next summer and you know when when covid is over everybody will want to go out right i think every single person in america will want to go out and enjoy themselves going to the beach going to the bar go out to eat and it will be the perfect time right i'm, I'm hope i'm hoping right it will be hey janice it will be the uh, the perfect time to wear this perfume. Uh, it's so beautiful. And you know, it's not like one of those loud, very loud, obnoxious perfumes, right? It's, you know, it, it, I mean, it's an oriental vanilla. Uh, it's for women and also for men. Uh, it came out in 2011, so it's been around for a while. And then for it to be around for a while and for people to still love it and still talk about it as much as they talk about it. So, you know, this is something that you know, if you're gonna buy, get yourself a, a something for Christmas. Uh, I have a few perfumes that I'm gonna talk about, but this one is definitely one of them. Something to put, you know, to put in your uh, Christmas want list. And you know, that, excuse me. Go ahead. I'm sorry. Yeah. I was just gonna ask. Would you say that's more rose, more vanilla? What? How it, would you? It's it's rose and vanilla. It's a rose and vanilla combination. Okay. It has lemon. It has a uh, uh, rose and sugar, and then they also have vanilla sugar, white moss, and cedar. So, so is it sweeter? It's sweet. It's a very sweet vanilla perfume. It, I mean, you know, it's it, it's worth every penny that you're going to spend for it. I think this is like my third or fourth bottle, seriously, since I've been buying Mancera. But it's not because I use I use it that much, but because it's it's a shareable perfume. It's something that you want to share with people. Right, yeah. you know, I said this last time. You know, this is a perfume that when you have it, it's so beautiful. You feel like you want to share it with people because it's just you know you want people to get to know the perfume. The, you know, it's really good stuff, really, really good stuff. And uh, thank you, th thank you, Andrea. It's just a great you know perfume to have. You know, it's it's very it's it's a perf perfume that I can. I wouldn't say that it's uh it's worth you know as a what do you call that? As as a signature mm -hmm. scent? It's not, no, it's not a signature scent perfume, but it's a perfume that you can wear at least you know three seasons of the year. It's um, Montero Roses and Vanille. Roses Vanille. Roses Vanille. Okay. Roses Vanille. Yeah, and of course it has my name, right? So it's perfect. <laughs> yeah, I I love it. I love this perfume, and I cannot stop. You know, I cannot talk about it enough enough about Roses Vanille. Okay. Yep. Uh, uh, someone's asking Rose for Berzana or Rosani. You know what? They're different. Rose's Berberenza is a little bit spicier than Rose's Vani. So if I had, you know, I have both of them. I, you know, if I'm wearing, if I'm, if I'm in a, in a mood to wear Rose's Berberenza, Rose's Vani, I would wear Rose's Vani during the day and then Rose's Berberenza at night. So I'm not saying that if you, if you shouldn't have both because they both are beautiful perfumes and I love both of them, right? But I think uh, Roses Vanille is a little bit less, you know, less expensive. You can get it for like maybe 90, 95 bucks or sometimes even $70 depending on where you're buying it from. But Roses Beberenza is like $200, you know, two some, what, $250, $200. So uh, this is a really good daytime perfume and I will even wear this at night. But Roses Beberenza is, you know, a little bit more, uh, I would say, uh more for, to go out right more to go out with where this one this is this could be your holy grail perfume to pick and wear whenever you want to and you don't have to worry about spending the money for it because you not only you get a big a, you know a huge big bottle and then you you spend less than 200 dollars for it it's actually less than 100 dollars 
I think so. Yeah, I think you yeah. can get it. And, you know, and I probably would be donating a few of those, you know, to some of my closest friends for Christmas because it's such a beautiful perfume. <laughs> yes. Awesome. Yeah. I don't want the truth. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, all right. Uh, what's your next one, Maddie? Uh, my next one. So I'm talking about um, pretty known fragrances tonight that are just yummy and delicious. So we all know this one. I don't even know if I should bring it up, but since we're talking yummy, it's another oriental spicy. Um, I think that's what. And... How many of us know this one? It's Greenwich Village by Bond. How many raised their hands? Bueller? <laughs> I love Greenwich um, Village. Yeah, this is a great one. It's uh, it's kind of sweet. It's kind of warm. I mean, very warm. And it just makes me feel like I'm being hugged. And um, I don't, I mean, in, in gathering the, the fragrances for tonight, Rose and I were talking, oh, Christy doesn't know it. Uh, yeah, Tyree put him onto that one. So uh, it's like a, a really warm, not super sweet, but it has some sweet tendencies to it. I wouldn't say it's a sugary fragrance. Would you, Rose? Uh, no, it's not. No, but I, it, I know you have it. Yeah, it's, um, not, it's not. Yeah, but it's, it's a great, I mean, it's a bond, first of all. Yeah, right? it's a wonderful bond. And um, yeah. I, I, let me see. I, I was taking notes on it, but I didn't get that far. So um, it has some really great accords in it. And I think, I mean, it, it has everything but the kitchen sink in it, but it comes together really nicely. It's a great kind of wear everywhere fragrance. I, I wouldn't wear it at night necessarily because I don't think it has the staying power for a real vampy, like a date night or, I mean, no. I guess it's, it's everybody. An afternoon, uh, going to a bar, perfume, uh, you know, yeah. Friday afternoon, going to happy hour. I think this is a great perfume for happy hour. Yeah, I, I would wholeheartedly agree. Yeah. So, um, so I think it's a pleasant winter fragrance, but it doesn't have to be. It could be good for other seasons. Um, it wouldn't be stifling in other seasons, but it would be great in cool weather. So that's okay. my assessment of Bond. Uh, number nine, Greenwich Village. And it comes oh. in a pretty turquoise bottle. It's a, it's a beautiful blue bottle. The, I mean, the, the camera doesn't do it justice. No, it doesn't. My lighting. Yeah. It's yeah. like yeah. a, yeah. a it doesn't do it justice. Yeah, it's, a, it's a beautiful turquoise bottle, yeah. So mm -hmm. let me address uh, uh, Pam's uh, question here. So, uh, or, or statement. Uh, it, is Roses Greedy is out of the running for the best rose? No, it's not. Roses Greedy is a play perfume. Okay, uh, Pam, it's your play uh, summer bomb perfume. During the day, you're going out, you're going out shopping, you're going out to meet friends for lunch. You want to bathe in a perfume. What is a greedy? Is the perfume greedy? Is the perfume to bathe in? It's it is very sweet and very rosy. A lot of people love. They either people either love it or they hate it. I've yet to talk to someone who who is in between, right? I love it because I love sweet perfumes at times, right? But I cannot stand it all, all the time. You would not see me wearing this maybe, you know, three times a day, three times uh, in a week. Uh, and who am I kidding? I don't wear perfume three times in a week anyway. <laughs> if I went uh, out of town and I only had one perfume with me, unless they had no perfume store in the, in, in the town, I would wear the same perfume three times in the same week. Otherwise, I would be, you know, traveling, with, you know, finding something else to wear. So let me it's, ask. Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, hey, Deb. So, see, this is the person. This person here will be the person to love Roses Greedy, and because she loves sweet perfumes, and I'm gonna send her a, a, a tester from it because she's gonna love it because she loves, you know, that kind of sweet perfume. She would love. Uh, Deb. Deb would love Roses Greedy. She would also love Roses Vanille because she's she likes garment go, go, perfume and very sweet perfumes. So uh, I hope I, I hope I have answered your question your question, Pam, regarding uh uh you know uh, uh between roses greedy and, and those other perfumes. I just wanted to ask you, Rose, um these are more sweet roses, is that what I'm understanding? Yes, they're full of sugar. Full okay, sugar. I was just yes. talking to a friend today about like more pure essential rose fragrances, and I pulled I think three from my collection 
if you like just a real pure rose fragrance, um, I pulled Rose Popon from Anique Boutal. I pulled uh, another one by Diptyque that was rose, I don't know, two roses yeah. by Anique Boutal and a rose by Diptyque that were very pure roses and no sweetness, but just a really lovely rose scent. So, you know, it's all over the border if you want sweet or true rose. Um, then there's, uh, what is it? The Rose Prick by Tom Ford that's also a good rose. Okay. You know? Yes, you're right. Uh, but those roses here, they're full of sugar. Right. The ones I'm talking yeah. about are not. Yeah. So, yeah. so they're not pure roses, but they're beautiful fragrances. Though. A really good, you know, uh, any woman will wear those fragrances and will feel like they're on top of the world because yeah. they, you know, people, they let people know, oh, look, this is a woman who's coming and she knows about, you know, about wearing sweet fragrances. Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, I love them. So what's your next one? I think it was your turn. Was it? No, did yeah. you do? Uh, you I did. did. did you do? No, you did one, I did one. Okay. All right. Yeah, you next. Um, you did the right version, right? And then I did the bond. Oh, oh, okay, so it's my turn. All right. Are you guys ready for this one? <gasps> Uh, okay, so if anybody can tell me what's my sweater perfume, they will get uh, uh, a decant of the uh, the one I just talked about. The the was the was what was his name? What's my sweater, sweater perfume? <laughs> anybody <laughs> remember which one is my sweater perf my sweater perfume? I will, I talked about it so many times. Nope, not Nishinani. Nishinani is not my sweater. I don't have a name for Nishinani. But that's coming up. Yep. Anybody can tell me what's my sweat, sweater perfume. I call it my sweater perfume. Okay, you guys don't know what my sweater perfume is. Something All yummy. Right. Something yummy. Uh, it's Killian. Nope. Lulu said it's Killian. Uh, no, uh, it's not it. Okay, so I'm not going to make people wait any, uh, any longer. So my sweater perfume is here. Suma Oriental in you know, Mad. Mm. Oh, guys. Mm. Look, 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 it's almost finished. Look how it's not almost finished, but it's like this much down. That's almost finished for Dr. Rose. Yeah, <laughs> it's almost it away. <laughs> uh, Joanne says, uh, Fev, no, Fev is, is my sweetie perfume, not my sweater perfume, Joanne. Uh, so oh, <laughs> he said I would have never guessed it right, let alone spell it right. <laughs> so, uh, Suma Oriental is the perfect perfume to wear in the fall, it is the perfect fall perfume. Uh, it is a uh, oriental woody fragrance for men and women. It came out in 2015, it has rum. Cacao, uh, uh, Cipriol oil, Nagamota, what the heck is that? And it has patchouli, tonka bean, sandalwood, guaiac wood, uh, cashmere, and moss. This is, you know, it was a blind buy for me. Of course, most of my perfumes are blind buy anyway, right? <laughs> but this is so beautiful. When I got it, I smell it, so I put it back in the box. And I walk around and I said, uh, what am I smelling? I went back and pulled it out and I said, no, this cannot be this good perfume in this little bottle. The bottle looks like nothing, right? It looks like a room spray, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Can you, can we spell it, Rose? Or yes, it again? Let, me, let me type it. I'm going to type it for you guys. Okay. Uh, uh, Lumisa probably wants me to type it, right? Lulu. Um, and Michelle is asking, so we're going to type it out and spell it. Oh, thank you, Chaperone. No. Okay, there's the name. Uh, Suma in Inuinomada. In you can get it. Uh, there's only one place you can get it, okay? You can get it uh, at uh, Lucky Scent. Awesome. Yep. So, my next one's, um, 
Uh, well, let's do Nishé Nani, which is my Christmas gift from someone. Oh, yeah. From someone very special. So I've been griping about this fragrance for a good long time. Oh, it just got all over my nose. <laughs> and I wanted to try it, wanted to try it, and it's been on my supply list, um, but I haven't bought it. <laughs> and then one day it showed up in my mail box. So I'm very grateful. It's a beautiful fragrance. Um, vanilla with some spice. Oh, it's a, it's a good unisex. Um, I, and I know these fragrances I'm talking about have been talked about a lot. But I just wanted to gather some good kind of wintry, comfy, uh, wear by anybody. Because the ones I brought up are pretty unisex so far. Um, it's an oriental, spicy, vanilla, not super sweet. Um, what would you like to say about it, Rose? What do you think about I call, it? I call Nisha and Annie a boozy perfume. Okay. Yeah. To me, you know, uh, when I first purchased it, uh, I was afraid to try it because I didn't know what to expect. A lot of people were talking about it in our perfume group. And then when I finally purchased it, I was like, wow, I cannot believe I waited this long to purchase this perfume. But, you know, I have not been able to wear it because I don't have any more because I, I bought it right before COVID, right? I have not been able to wear it as much as I want would want to because I don't have anywhere to go to wear it. Right. It's, it's, so, a, it's a big, it's a heavy hitter. Where's my put it, put it further that way. Move it the other way. Let's see. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It, it, it's a heavy hitter perfume. And... Uh, it's, you know, it's kind of scary for people who don't know, who don't like boozy perfumes. Some people think that it's too masculine for them. But to me, it's not it's not too masculine because I like strong perfumes. I don't find it masculine like, at all. I mean, uh, like, it, 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 ha it could be pulled off masculine, but I don't find it, um, how can I say, it's not a sweet, foofy vanilla, but I don't find it strictly masculine either. No, well, Michelle said try Leonard with Akivat. I don't have Akivat because I heard that it's 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 kind of mas masculine. This is why I did not buy Akivat. But I'm really glad that I bought uh, Annie. Yeah, I'm glad Annie, I have yeah. it. And yeah, I'm, I'm glad I have it. It's you know it's gonna be part of my collection for a very long time. It's a, yeah, yes, Cheryl, it is a special perfume. It's very special, and I guess yeah. what I would say is um, sorry, whoa, I got behind on the comments. Sorry, guys. Um. I guess what I would say is if your expectation is like a very sweet, uh, you know, not, I don't want to be disparaging, but like a Bath and Body Works or Victoria's Secret vanilla, this is not what you're going to get. That is no. not it. If you want a sugary vanilla, this is not it. This is a blast away, like, fill the room. Yeah. Just strong. Um, has some powdery, has some soft spice, just a big fragrance, and it's amazing. You know, yeah. um, it, 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 it has a lot of personality. That's what I see. It has a lot of personality, and I think yeah. it takes someone with some personality to pull it off. You know, I think you have to have a certain attitude at the time you wear it to wear it. <laughs> if that makes yeah. sense. So, I don't see, know. No, you need just, just, just put this, you know, Looney, uh, you need just, you know, set it right. Definitely a different experience of vanilla. It's not I your wouldn't say it's vanilla. mature vanilla, Nadia. I wouldn't no. say it's mature necessarily because I love it and I'm not necessarily mature. No. <laughs> yeah. I'm just, it's very you know what? It's a mature perfume, though. It's, a, it's, it's not, some, it's, a, it's a mature perfume. It's you not know, a mature perfume. No. Yeah. People who are going to enjoy this are people who like unique fragrances, like Joanne said. You have to have a, like, like a unique fragrance. Exactly. And if you don't have any vanilla perfume, if you've never had any vanilla perfumes, do not buy this perfume yet because it, it, it might change your mind about vanilla perfumes because it's a different kind of vanilla. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. And, yeah. um, uh, all right. So, so says it's not so much about attitude as the preference. I would agree. You know, I think it's both, uh, whatever you like. And, and I think there's something in the preference that, marks your attitude it's whatever you want i mean it's so subjective so yeah yeah it's, it's a great one it's a powerful one it's uh it's definitely something i would recommend for um for trying out for a winter set i i, yeah. I think it would get heavy during summer so 
Oh yeah. Oh no. I wouldn't wear that in the summer. Definitely. No. Maybe a summer cool night, you know, when summer just start kicking in. Uh, but I would not wear this like when it's really, really hot. No, it don't do that. Yeah. yeah. No. Uh, uh, it, become, it will become too sticky, too sticky on you. Yeah. So okay, I'm gonna talk about my next one. And okay, it's a red bottle. From one of my favorite houses. Ooh. Houses. It's a red yes. bottle. Yes. It can only be one of two. Yeah, I know. Yeah, and it doesn't last. It doesn't last at all. And I spoke about it last week when I, uh, when I was doing uh, my uh, top, uh, my uh, perfume for my favorite house. I mean, not my favorite house. When I was doing the live regarding my entire collection, and I talked about that perfume. Uh, nope, it's not Chan it's not Chanel. Uh, uh, Cheryl. Oh, that's a good guess because I gave her the red Chanel bottle. But yeah, no, it, yeah. Not, not accurate. Oh, on common sense, got it. <laughs> you went to you went to yes. in the room and scary. you wanted to guess on this. Yeah, he guessed it. Yeah. Uh, Nina said uh, your pause or no, it's not your pause. I did talk about that for real, but it's not, it's not it. Yeah, so on common sense, got it. So lost, lost MF Cherry. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. She went, she lost your cherry, and oh, just kidding. Sorry. Okay, guys, this perfume does not last. I think the most I get out of it is maybe four hours, four, five hours. But my goodness, it is real, it is a real, real cherry. And I don't care what they say about it not lasting a long time, I will put it in my purse, I will travel with it just so that I can wear it again. Uh, I love, love, love this perfume. Okay. It was launched in, in 2018. It's an oriental floral fragrance. Uh, and the person who created it was Louise Turner. So a woman created this perfume. So she knew exactly what she was doing, except, you know, at the lab, in the lab, I guess they just couldn't, you know, make it last longer. But if they ever come out with a, with a, with a, uh, intense version, guess what? I'm buying the intense version. That would be mind blowing. That would be, oh, be mind -blowing. blowing. So it has sour <laughs> cherry, sour cherry, bitter almond and liquor. Uh, the middle notes are sour cherry again, plum, Turkish rose, jasmine sambac. The base notes are tonka bean, perusa uh, balsam, vanilla benzoin, cinnamon, uh, cedar, cloves, vetiver, and patchouli. So mm -hmm. when I say the cherry and the almond, you know, uh, took over this perfume, I am like dead serious. I don't know why they call it lost cherry, but the cherry is not lost. Um, <laughs> yeah. Have you seen the ad campaign, Rose? Like, no, the uh -uh. ad campaigns, no. some of them are not safe for work. Like, oh, really? they're, oh, okay. they're pretty hardcore. So well, his, his, most of his perfumes name are not safe for, for work, right? <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. Uh so that was you uh, your favorite house is uh perfume. Well, it's one of them. I have several favorite houses. And you know, I need to stop saying that because I you know, in every single perfume house that I have in my cabinet, there is one that I love. Right? There's one perfume that I love. So, but you know, I love this one. Uh and I don't wear it a lot because I don't want to, you know, it's expensive to begin with. And I don't want to work to work where I'm going to, going to uh, uh, have, you know, people be smelling cherry all day long because this is a going out perfume. It's not, you know, an everyday perfume. And it cannot be a signature scent either. Yeah, no, it's just it's it's beautiful. It's too much to wear all the time. So on common sense, are you going to give uh, give away your uh, the decant perfume that you want uh, from me? Or you, because uh, since you answered that question, you get to have a test of this one. And I don't know if you uh if you still if you want to test or if you if you already have it. He probably already has it. Well don't take his away. <laughs> no, no, I'm not taking it away. I, I, no, I'm not I'm taking kidding. it away. Yeah, so on common sense uh gets a uh a decad of something, right? Mm-hmm. Cute. Yeah. Okay, you next, Marty. Okay, uh, one moment, please. Oh, so I got some pretty heady scent mail the other day. 
Um, this is like, okay, where's my camera? I'm new at this. Yep, you this find is it. Like my favorite, favorite coffret by Killian. It's the Memento Mori box with the skull that holds the Black Phantom. And it has the cute. Uh, Do I I can't can't but, yes. Okay, it has the oh, little. Wow. Has a key. There's a key. A key, yeah. Why can't I do this? Yoink, I did it. Okay. Uh uh, push it the other other side. There we go. Okay. Wow. It, oh wow. It looks like a coffin for real. Yeah, it is a coffin. And there's the the black phantom. So sorry that was <laughs> I'm no sorry, good man. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. In my house it does look like a book end. So um the black phantom, so it no longer comes in that coffret. Um I looked for it for years, and for a How long time I didn't it? want to buy it. How um, did you find it? It is fancy, and I love it. <laughs> and it's so my personality. Oh, did Pam review it? Um, well, so it's got a lot of patchouli in it too. And I, have, I, I love it. it. I love it. I love it. It's but this is sweet. It's got like some caramel, chocolate, uh, coffee, wood, almond, vanilla. I mean, it's got everything delicious and wonderful in there, plus some wood and patchouli and um, powder and uh, spice in it. I mean, it's got it all. So you can see there's a trend in the kind of fragrances I'm presenting tonight. And this one, um, just wow. Um, it's it's calmer, I think, maybe a little softer than the Ani, maybe. I don't know. Uh -huh, okay. Would you agree with that? Like, not as biting? Oh, no. Ani is much better than that. I love that perfume. No, I'm not saying better. I'm not saying better. I'm this saying one is, this, I think Ani is more uh, uh, spicy. Yes, that's what I'm trying to say. Yeah. That's yeah, what I'm trying to say. Yeah. That's a more spicy, spicier. Oh my God! What's, what's my, what are my manners? So, um, let's see. Maybe the coffee made it like tar. Huh? Yes, I agree, Nina. It's a very heavy nighttime perfume. Um, oh yeah, absolutely. Very heavy yeah. nighttime, not daytime. Yeah, I wouldn't I mind it, a bit, you know, because I wanted to try it so I could talk about it. But yeah, it's not uh, nighttime, winter, fall night, winter night, definitely. Yeah. It smells That's like the Witherers candies to me. You know the Witherers hard toffee. You know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. That's what it smells like. It smells like it can yeah. taste like that. But anyway, I love but the bottle. Beautiful. Yeah, it's a beautiful coffee, though. I love the the coffee. Um, it's very me. So that's my one of my latest acquisitions. Um, but yeah, next one. Oh, and now now he's in. He's, he's streaming us. Uh, he's streaming us from his other from his from his own channel. Thank you, I, have to be, I have to be here because he's gonna be talking about me. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Yeah. Well, there's no behaving. There's no such thing as behaving for Dr. Rose. Yeah, he's gonna talk about me. I know that. You better talk about her. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So all right. So my next one is. Uh. So it's one of the perfumes that I spoke about uh, in my doing my uh, uh, perf my entire perfume collection part two the other day. Uh, can someone tell me the name? I'm trying to give something away. Can someone win something tonight? Uh, can you tell me the name of that uh, one of the perfumes that I talked about the other day? It's a, it's it's in a blue bottle. It was it was the blue bottle from the uh, Carolina Herrera collection. Stop there if I win them all, guys. Yeah, please <laughs> try to win something. <laughs> it's not every day that I give a full bottle of perfume out. Make her happy. Let her give. She wants to give. <laughs> okay, where are the comments? Nobody's comment. Nobody saying anything. Where are they? I know they're still here. There are 43 of them here. 43 people. Come on. Somebody guess. Blue Carolina Herrera. Is that what you said? Yep. Look it up. Oh, my gosh, you guys. <laughs> huh? Who got it? 
Okay. The okay. Amani Privé. No, it, no, it's not Amani Privé. It, it, it was, uh, I did not talk about Amani, Amani Privé the other day, did I? No, I did not. You were, you the were. blue barrel was so pretty. Christy said she, the blue barrel was so pretty. I don't know. <laughs> <sighs> okay. All right. So, no, uh, okay. Well, I'm going to come back to it. I'm going to give you guys. Uh, yep. Saffron Lazuli. Need a ride. All right. It, it, even though it's, so, it's, uh, it's not Lazuli, it's, it's Lazuli, but it's, it, yeah, uh, Nina got it. Ah, Nina. Yeah, Nina got Nina got you know. Uh, <laughs> Michelle said uh, she has so many. <laughs> yeah, right. I know. Gillian said I know it, but you know she cannot be part of it because she's the one who actually created uh, uh, wrote, uh researched my notes for tonight for me. Nobody researched my notes. Uh, I don't have them there. <laughs> well, okay, it happens when you you know when you're uh, a YouTuber. You're not a YouTuber. I've been after you to become a YouTuber. You don't want to become a new YouTuber. Okay, okay, whatever. <laughs> so, Nina, right? I'm just a lowly peon that has to do my own homework. <laughs> it's, a lot, it's a lot of work. Being on YouTube is, is a lot of work. I know, that's so, why I don't want to do it. Nina, right? Uh, you have, uh, you're going to get, a, uh, I don't know if you have that perfume already, but it's one that I give out a lot. Uh, Le Parfum uh, by. What's the name of it? Lalik. Lalik. Lalik Le Parfum. Would you like Lalik Le Parfum, Nina? Nina? Nina Wright? Nina. I want to try the rose burning and the ember one. What was burning in ember one? Oh, I think she's just in a conversation. Nina writing, um, do you want to try the perfume Lalik? What was burning? I think they're talking about something else. Um, oh, okay. All right. Amani Privé, maybe? I don't know. But um, anyway, Nina, let us know what you want, if you want, and we'll figure yeah. it out. Yep, we'll figure it out. Okay. So, Rose, do one more. Um, I have to do one more? If you don't mind. No, I haven't even shown the perfume yet. Oh, I that's didn't know. Yeah. That's what I was talking about. Okay. And Lu Lulu said, hey, Oud Kuchu. I don't have Oud Kuchu, uh, uh, Lulu. Uh, oh, okay. So Nina said, yes, sure. She'll take the Lalik. Okay. All right. I will send it out tonight, Nina, because I'm, I'm going to get it directly from the from the store to send it to you. So I don't have to, to, to mail, it, mail, it, mail it to you. Lalik. Okay. All right. Okay. So Saffron Lazuli. Uh, Again, you know, you guys. Oh, I cannot, I cannot get enough of this perfume. <laughs> it's a little spicy girl. perfume. It came out this year. It came out in in twenty twenty, right? Uh, it has saffron, tonka bean, black currant, iris and rose, leather, vanilla, and bright wood. And for some reason, you know what? I would put it, if it wasn't because of the letter, I would put it in the same category as uh, this perfume here. Wow. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Here, yeah, I would put it in the same category. And Except this, one, yeah, this, one has some, has, this one has some almond and it doesn't, and this one has some leather and this one doesn't. But they are similar, except this one lasts and this oh. one doesn't last. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She she all of them from different places, Christy. Some she got from Dubai, some she got from Europe. She's been really hardcore collecting them for a while. Yeah, so, uh, and I think I, I said that. So some of them I got from Europe, uh, some of them I got from Dubai, some of them I got from the States, from the States. Uh, I think Sakon Lazuli was from uh, Europe, I, uh, Europe. Yeah, I think it was from Europe. And then I got... Uh, some other ones I got from the States and some from Dubai. Uh, I have so many. I think I have how many? Uh, two, four, six, eight, ten of them. Ten? Yeah, ten, I think. I think I have a total of ten of them. And, you know, uh, they still have some here. This, I mean, Fragrance X has, has a few. So you guys should check them out. They have a few of them. 
Yes, okay, so you next. Okay. So you oh, guys, yeah. you guys, be ready for the next one because there's a gift coming up with the next one also. Come on. <laughs> so should I go back red? Yeah, go back red. Go back red. Okay. Yeah. So we talked about this guy that rotates, right? <laughs> the Luby Croc. And then I also got, um, I think this one's Luby Rouge. And I, Ooh, I, I, like I, I, I like the top of this one. Yeah, this one has a little cat. I don't know how to how to um, focus. That's a cat, right? Little cat with lipstick, and she's got um, she. Yeah, I don't know if you know the uh, the Louboutin lipstick line. They have a really good cosmetics line, but these are after their little lipsticks. And she's got a little lipstick here, a little crown. These are really made creatively, and they've got a weight to them that's really spectacular. Um, this one is supposed to have strawberry. It's supposed to have um, rose. It's supposed to have a lot of stuff. I have a friend who does fragrance reviews, and she said that Pepper up and punched her in the face with this one. I don't get it. I get the strawberry and I get the rose. Um, but, yeah, it's very uh, sweet and, and floral to me. Um, maybe even a little, I, I don't know, it's lovely. Um, nothing. <laughs> yeah, it does look totally like an Asian lucky cat. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> but um that's not what i'll be wearing um it's it's just not <laughs> well you know it's all part of what you like and i like the croc and i don't like cats <laughs> but anyway um hope i didn't offend anyone with that comment but um <laughs> anyway um the thank, you. thank you jesse should I should I continue to share the red or thank you, JC? Or no, 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 we, we can, let me do one and then you can do. Uh, are you done with your red? I, you like I did it? that one, yeah. I you like the token? Do you one like one. the perfume, Mari? What? Do you like the perfume? No. <laughs> you know? Honestly, well, um, it's not a bad perfume. Uh, honestly, these guys aren't just wowing me as much as i hope they would um it's it's not offensive oh i'm sorry unique <laughs> well, we still love you please come back <laughs> but um anyway um it's not it's an, totally inoffensive i know some people would love it because it's kind of sweet it's kind of floral uh if you like strawberry fruity or um or rose, it's, it's very is it worth the Is it worth the price tag? That's the question. I don't think so. You think so? Okay. All right. Because they're pretty expensive. But I have one. I have one of them, and I'm not going to share it now because I, want, I haven't even opened it yet because I want to do an, uh, a first impression video with it. And I, I think hers is better because we went down the notes. and Yeah. So I haven't opened mine yet. It's still sitting in, in a box, and I don't know what it smells like. And I'm not going to discuss it now because I don't want uh, to ruin the surprise. Okay. Uh, but I will do a first impression video, video with it, uh, and you know, post it. It will be very short, seven minutes, and I will be giving out a tester from it, not a decant, a tester. Yeah, I know. So. Uh, and then we'll talk about it. So my next perfume. Okay, you guys ready? Uh, ready. Because we don't, I'm going to give the, another full bottle of perfume. If you guys guess this one, I'm going to tell you about the perfume. I'm going to tell you about the notes. And then you guys, it, it's a very well-known perfume, okay? It was, it's an oriental fragrance for men and women. It was launched in 2002. Uh, the, the notes behind the fragrance is Thierry Washer. Top notes are blackberry and mandarin. Uh, and mandarin, uh, blackberry, mandarin leaf. Middle notes are jasmine, uh, night blooming uh, cereus, orange blossom and rose. Base notes are vanilla, tonka bean, and sandalwood. Ooh. It was, uh, it's in a blue bottle and it's very tall. It's tall. 
Can someone guess that perfume? Okay, all right. Uh, so, any any takers? Can someone get that perfume? And the the gift the person gets, the person gets a perfume in, in a word battle. And it it is not this one, okay? So I'm just gonna be honest. It's not that one. You don't get this one, but you you'll get a perfume in a, in a word battle. She got it. Woo! <laughs> yep, she got it. How did how did you how did you get it, Janice? I just want to know how did you how did you guess it? And Michelle said it. Michelle said it after Janice said it. Wow, guys, good job. Yep. So Janice got it. So Janice, hold on. You will get a full bottle of uh, Ambre Doria. Wow. Awesome. Congratulations, Janice. Um, Faima said that Jennifer Latifa did a video on Luby Rouge and said it was a unique, outstanding fragrance. Um, that's fine. You know, everybody's subject to their own opinions. And as I said at the beginning, I have a hard time with a lot of fragrances. They give me migraines. And I, I, you know, we, I, we, can that, we can close that subject now because we, we're no longer talking about the Luby Woods, right? Okay, next one. Yeah, we don't have to adjust that. Everyone has, you know, their own opinion with fragrance because, you know, yeah. So, uh, Janice, would uh, would you like this perfume or not? Let me show you what the bottle looks like. It's a beautiful bottle. Oh, cute! Yeah, it's a beautiful, and the perfume smells really nice too. Yeah, it smells, it smells really nice. Uh, it's amber. It has amber. Uh, you, you can research the note, but it's, it's a beautiful fragrance. Uh, I cannot see it because I don't have my glasses. I don't think the note's in, on the back of the, the box anyway. But uh, it's, so any, and any fragrance uh, were different on everyone. Yes, Michelle is right. Uh, fragrances smell different on, on, on different people. Yeah, okay. Okay. So Janice said she's excited. Okay. All right. So I have Jan Janice down for the uh, for this one, and you you will get yours very quick, Janice, because I'm gonna order it tonight, and it will get to you very 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 fast. Uh, make sure, please make sure you send me your address. Uh, either uh, email me your address. Or send send it to me uh, on uh, Insta via Instagram, please. All right. Uh, okay. So let let's talk about this this uh, perfume. Uh, talk about the vanilla bomb. This is this perfume here, the the one that Janice Janice just now uh, talked about. And I have this is. Uh, the one that I've had this one for a very long time. Uh, it, it. Well, you guys know about the top notes. The notes already. This is this is one of the most gorgeous uh, vanilla perfumes out there. I don't. I, I'm not saying it's the best, but this is like you know going out perfume, ladylike, right? You, I mean, you cannot go wrong. I, I've yet to meet someone when Dior did this perfume, when they made this thing, they knew exactly what they were doing. They plan it, they project manage it, and came out with a beautiful, uh, uh, you know, oriental floral, floral perfume. It's super sexy, really good to wear. It's very long lasting. It stays on your skin for a very long time. And Janice, do you have this perfume? If you don't have it, I, I'm happy to send you a tester. Of it with you know, uh with with your uh ember though yeah except they'll be coming from a different they'll be coming from different locations. I absolutely love love this perfume and sometimes you know I forget about it because it's so down, so so darn tall I put it like way in the back of anything and I forget that I have it. Uh uh Chrissy said I think your vanilla is the one vanilla for me. I think I will ask for for, for Christmas. Oh definitely definitely. Yeah, definitely. 
Uh, Angela said, beautiful fragrance, love that one. Yes, everybody, I think everybody loves this perfume. Uh, Michelle said, which one is that? It's Dior, Michelle. It's Dior Addict. And don't buy the other toilet. This is the other toilet. The other toilet is okay, right? But you want to get the other puffer. If, if, and if you can find one that, that probably came out in, 2000, in 2002, get the 2002 version. Because uh, I don't think it was reformulated, but I still, you know, I still like when, you know, something that was there, you know, before, you know, they change or anything like that. Uh, Julia said she's gonna pick up that one. She loves vanilla. Yes, Julia, it, you will not regret it. This, you know, this could be your Thanksgiving perfume. Well, no, this could be a Christmas, Christmas perfume. This is more like you know Christmas perfume. I think your Thanksgiving perfume. This is <laughs> definitely a Thanksgiving perfume. Okay. Okay. So we got a Thanksgiving and a Christmas perfume. Yeah, this yeah this is this is your Christmas perfume. The Dior Attic. You know, very, very nice for, 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 for Christmas, too, for Christmas. Even though I don't think we're going to have much of a Christmas this year, but you can still dress up, you know, and stay home, right? <laughs> yeah. And the Christmas tree all by yourself. Yeah, and Nina said she has the 2002 version. It smells the same as the current version. Okay, all right. So right. They, they have not changed it. All right. Okay, Th thanks for letting us know, uh, Nina. All right, cool. you are next, buddy. Okay, um, what do I want to do next? I want to do, so one of the notes I love that is per pervasive through all of these um, fragrances I pulled up tonight is Tonka. I really love the Tonka note. So when I came across Guerlain's Tonka Imperial, I bought it. And um, it's good. <laughs> you it's, it, yeah. yeah, we can still get cute for ourselves on Christmas. Heck yeah. Um, it's really lovely. Yeah. Um, it uh, let's see. I pulled it up because I wanted to talk about it. It's kind of sweet. And do, do you guys know what Tonka smells like? Does anybody like Tonka besides me? I, I have to look it up. Yeah, it's like a bean. And um, ultimately, this one, the gear, the gear law has. Um, it's kind of nutty. And again, with what the is that? huh. Which one is this one? This is the Tonka Imperial. Oh, this is this is a beautiful perfume. I know. That's why I'm talking about it. <laughs> but um, it's warm. It's sweet. It's almondy. It's uh, got. It says it's got some tobacco, but I don't read the tobacco in it. Um, I don't have any tobacco in it. What? I don't smell tobacco in it. I don't either. I don't either. No, no, um, no. And it also says it's fruity, but I don't get the fruit in it either. Um, top notes are bitter almond, rosemary, and bergamot. Middle notes are tonka bean, tobacco, and jasmine. Base notes are incense, cedar, and pine. I don't get a lot of those from it, but it's a beautiful fragrance. Um, oh, Lulu says it smells like honey on her, but she liked it in this one, the tonka. Um, yeah, I just, I love Gear Law. Um, I don't buy a lot of their fragrances. I don't, well, I have a bunch of them, but I don't know how long they last anymore. How do you feel about how long the, the Gear Lines last, Rose? Um, mine give me about 12 hours. Okay. All right. Yeah. Well, um, I mean, I, I have a lot of that. I from this, house, from this one, that in that same, uh, bottle, uh, yeah, give me about 12 hours. Two hours, okay. Yes. And this one's a heavier one. I'm thinking more along the Aqua Allegorias and those. Um, oh, no, Aqua Allegoria. You cannot put put them in the same uh, in the same category. Well, no. I'm just thinking my other girl one. I like I have the Muguet and I have those and and those are lighter. This one's a heavier one, and it's a lot. Oh, yeah. Definitely. So anyway, this is a so good one. To cover body. What? Someone give you a compliment. Oh, thank you. Let's see. Maddie has great taste. I like how if you don't like a perfume, you just say it as you. <laughs> well, you know, whatever. But um, but anyway, this one I like, and it's 
it's beautiful, it's delicious, it's good for winter, and it has good staying power. That's what I will say about that one. <laughs> and thank you, Cheryl. I, I like the hard beer, y'all. The one I don't the one I don't like is the new one that I paid a bunch of money for when it first came out. I had to call all over to Vegas to buy. It's the Irish one. I oh, I don't like that one. Yeah. Sorry. And and I'm gonna I'm gonna sell it on eBay. If anybody's gonna, gonna give me one hundred bucks for it, I'm gonna sell it to them. I don't like the Irish one. It's a beautiful perfume. I just don't like it. I just I just don't see myself wanting it enough to keep it. That's yeah. the read on and this it. Is like, I did not even, even review it. Yeah. Because I, I expected more from from girl from girl. I did. No, uh, all right. So, oh, never mind. Huh? Go, ahead. Go ahead. So my next one. Ah, if anyone can guess that other perfume, I'm, I will give you guys uh, another bottle of. Uh, I will give you another bottle of Ambrodoria. Uh, uh, I will give another bottle. Uh, so let me tell you the notes. Uh, oriental woody fragrance for women and men, launched in 2012. The notes behind this fragrance is, uh, oh, I cannot tell you the name of the person who, because it's a person, the name of the, the person is the name, the notes behind it. Yep. Top notes of uh, cloves and spices, middle notes of uh, labdanum, vanilla absolute, and Peru balsam, base mm. notes of dry wood, agar wood, and cedar. So uh, I talked about this perfume once in my channel, doing a, doing a live, and then I told someone that I needed to find a bigger bottle because there was a small bottle. And then the person was like, yeah, you can find it. And I found the, the bigger bottle. Uh, Nina said tobacco vani. No, Nina, that's not it. Uh, it's not that. This one is, a, is, a, is an ember, ember perfume. So the first name on the perfume is ember. What color is the bottle? Uh, clear. <laughs> this top is black. It's not, well, I mean, if you say Tom Ford, show, you have to tell me which Tom Ford, but it's not Tom Ford. <laughs> Hi, for you, yeah. Welcome. Someone says MLK. Uh, I don't know where MLK is. Martin Luther King. Hey, I don't know. hey, thank you for being here. Oh, hold it. Hold it, hold it, hold it. It's your husband. What was you I mean, I mean, I have to do this. Hold it. <laughs> yeah. That's my YouTube husband. Hey, lover boy. <laughs> Thank you for being here. <laughs> uh, oh, someone said, uh, uh -huh. uh, It's not Ombre Centrico. Uh, someone says, uh, Cardesian Gansua. Nope. Uh, Miley said, uh, Her husband is here. <laughs> Maddie, you are funny. <laughs> uh, nope, it's not satin wood either. Oh my God, you guys are really trying. Montal was his most intense. No, actually, it's not uh, because it does it does not have any any uh, the notes from Montal. Well, a few of the notes, but it's not it. Uh, Oriental wood. <laughs> Oriental woody. <laughs> Elfin is trying really hard. Uh, Elfin's a okay. uh, uh, Ombre Nugil? No. Who said what? Amber Nugil? Nugil? And Nina Rise. What's that oh, one? Oh, I don't know. I don't even know that, what that is. I don't know that one either. Yep. You guys are having too much time, but you're wrong. Huh? <laughs> They're having too much fun guessing, but they aren't guessing the right one. I know. Uh, Black and Bizarre. I don't know what that one is. I have no idea what this one is, uh, 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 Belinda. Udbani, Zara, uh, Amber no. Someone said this game's making them crazy. They're going to start making names. Up. <laughs> no. Hi, Fofa. Uh, Fofa, Fofa from Hades in the house. Hi, hey, Fofa. Hi, Erin. Erin's in the house. Hey, Erin. Erin is here. Hello, Erin. Uh, okay, so I think they're making names up now because they're saying uh, it's uh, uh, someone says Ralph Lauren. It's not Ralph Lauren. Hi, Rock and Robin. Thank you for coming. 
Oh, Rock. Uh, oh, she, yeah. Oh, hi, Rock and Robin. Uh, okay, so you guys cannot guess it. So I'm just going to, sh should I show it? Right? Yeah, nobody's winning anything for this one. Oh, someone said, please say the notes again. Okay, the notes again are uh, cloves, cloves and spices, middle notes are uh, labdanum, vanilla absolute, and peru balsam. The base notes are white wood, agar wood, and cedar. Someone said uh, black opium. Someone said, go ahead and give it up. <laughs> Good up, Dr. Rose. I'm done with this crap. Just go ahead and give it up. <laughs> Deborah said, just tell us, Dr. Rose. Okay. Ooh, that's coming out from a long time ago. There it is. Renya J. Ember Loop. Okay. Uh, someone Facebook said, uh, uh, if it's for, no, it's it's actually, it's, it's, uh, it's unisex. Most of my perfumes are unisex, guys. So, if you guys ever want one of the best ember fragrances okay is this this is this perfume here uh you can get the smaller bottle for like maybe 120 or 130 but the larger bottle this one is a little bit more expensive but it's the larger bottle is hard to find i think this lady renya j so her full name is renya uh Joanne. uh when she made this perfume I think she probably had a, uh, some kind of uh, uh, contact with this guy who made this perfume because they got it right. This perfume, guys, will last the entire day on you. It's sexy. It's beautiful. It's dark. It's not like uh, I'll put it in the same category as Tom Ford uh, Noir Extreme. It's super, super nice. And uh, I sold my, my smaller bottle because I really wanted uh wanted uh you know a bigger one so I had to, to to buy the, the big the larger bottle. Hi Andy Sus, thanks for being Hi. here. Yeah, I really, really, really love this perfume. You know, so I think yeah. I would say these two here, I would call these two kind of like maybe my sweat. This one is could be my sweater perfume too. Hey Nat. I agree, Nat. So she said this question are harder than Jeopardy. <laughs> no, they're not. <laughs> yeah. Ember uh, Ember I mean em, uh, Ember Loop by Renia 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 R A N I A J is uh really it's a really fantastic, you know, uh, beautiful perfume. All right. So uh no one got this one. So the uh, I'm gonna give the uh, the uh, gift in the with the other perfume I'm gonna talk about. How many perfumes do you have left, Rose? Uh just uh two more. Okay. What about you? Okay. I can make it work. Well, I kinda have one, kinda three, but it's okay, but I have a few more. I mean if people are still here who can talk because I've i you know, I, I, I have some stuff I can give away. Well, I pretty much have one, but we'll figure Everyone it out. Said, no, hold on. Can you uh, say the name of the, uh, type the name of the perfume? Let me, I'll, I'll do it. Okay. Uh, you can talk, Mighty, Mighty, while I type this name. So I have, I love patchouli. And I don't love, uh, I don't want to step on anybody's toes here. I don't love a real strong, uh, is it patchouli? I said it. I said it. <laughs> But I love patchouli. So um, in Paris, in the 90s, I went into a little store called Fia La Vanille, um, Place Saint-Germain. And it, I bought uh, this patchouli, which is Fia La Vanille Romanesant. And where is it? this is my signature scent. You can tell it's almost gone. I've been through countless bottles. And um, it's by Romani Sans, and it's powdery, it's uh, vanillic, it's uh, warm, it has everything you want out of a good patchouli that's not stinky and B.O. and everything bad that patchouli can potentially have. Um, so they reformulated that one into this, is the new packaging, hold on. 
this is the new packaging. It's still a Renaissance, but it does not. This is Patchouli Blanc. And they have a whole line of these. They have an Oud. They have a Vanille. They have an Amber. Um, I just really like the Patchoulis. Um, and then my friends in France couldn't find the Renaissance. And, oh, we have commercials being played over our live. Well, yeah. Well, you have to get paid. Yeah, that's how we get paid. So, <laughs> that's yeah. how I get the big bucks. No. Yeah. No, you two have to get paid. I mean. But sorry. anyway, um, yeah. Mademoiselle Wood Patchouli, which is this one, smells very much like them. Well, I've got it backwards. Hold on. And this is Natalie Wood's. Oh, I love that bottle. Yeah, it's pretty. So they took um, this one's called, you can barely see it at the bottom. It's called Tendre Soupir, Tender Wishes, or something uh -huh. like that. Um, so they're all about the same kind of patchouli. Um, which one you can get depends. They're all like $100, $120 model. And I generally do about five sprays with these because it's a very subtle one. It's a subtle one. And like, I don't spray anything more than once, ever. And I walk through it. This one, you can spray, you don't reek, although my car smells like it, but <laughs> my signature percent. This is what I smell like. So um, I wanted to share these three with you as just, if you like patchouli, it's a good one. So, is it sweet? Is it a sweet patchouli? Um, it's not sugary sweet, but it is sweeter. Yes. Because I love sweet patchouli. I think sweet yeah. patchouli, you know, with know patchouli mixed with, with ember. Uh, is that yeah. all you have left? Yeah. Well, I have a, I have two more bottles, but this is all. Oh, I have. excuse. Me. Oh, wow. Okay. I stocked up on this one because they aren't making it anymore. Okay. Well, can you send this one to your to your black sister? I sent you the lotion to my black sister. Oh, okay. It, did you like it? Yes, I still have the lotion. Okay, I'll send you some of this one too if you like it. Um, so the Natalie Wood has more the 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 Fiamma the, or the Romanesol, I'd say has more vanilla and sweetness. The Natalie Wood is more powdery. Someone vanilla. said uh, Lulu said she used to layer that reminiscence one. It's very layerable. I would agree with that. Yeah. Um, what did you layer it with, Lulu? You love patchouli more than, yeah, me too, Erin. I love patchouli more than a hippie. I don't love the hippie patchouli. <laughs> but anyway, that's I don't know what that means, but I'm just going to laugh at anyway. Yeah. Okay. Well, anyway, those are my, I guess, last three. I have two more I can, two more I can kind of talk about. Oh, I've got three more I can talk about. So I'm next. Here. I'm next. You're next. Yeah? Yeah. All right. Yeah, Okay. Uh, oh, what happened is, is uh, uh, a lot of unfortunately people do move in a way like us. Oh. Thank you, though. Thank you. Thank you, Robinson. Uh, uh, All right. So for those of you who don't know this guy, this guy here, pe guys, people don't believe when I say this. He is my brother. <laughs> uh that's my real brother, same mom, same dad. Well, all of my sisters and brothers are the same, same mom, same dad. He's my younger brother. He lives, he lives in Canada. And then he's one of my biggest supporters. Out of my family, he's the one person who supports my channel the most. So I did tell him that uh, whenever I get uh, monetized, my first uh, money from uh, YouTube is going to him. So he did receive it. Yay. It wasn't a lot. It was a dollar nineteen. He got it. No, it was a little bit more. But I told him that whatever I made, it was gonna go to him, so it went to him. Yeah. So if you guys see him in the, in, in you know, here, uh, so just know that you know he's, you know, he's his family. He's, he's my brother. He must be good people then. He's coming. Yeah. To she said he looks just like me. Yes, he does. Yeah. He, we all look alike. All of my sisters, sisters and brothers, we all look alike. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you. Oh, and comment says you, you, you need to add one more dollar to so I can ship you all your stuff. I'm just joking. 
<laughs> oh, I'm just joking. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, in we had that. Remember that live we had the other day with four hours, four and a half hours live. One of us in that live was talking. Came with a uh, perfume she had. She purchased two bottles of the same perfume. One oh of them was God. an older bottle. The other one was it was uh, a newer one. And so we were given. I, I think Pam was giving her uh, uh, a hard time and Lulu because she had two bars of the same perfumes. So if you guys can think, can guess which which bar, which you know, you don't have to guess the name of the perfume. You can tell me the name of the house, and I will uh, donate another bottle of this one, of this one. Did you go on a shopping spree of those? <laughs> huh? Did you wipe out the stock of that no, one? No, I only have this one. This I'm gonna keep this one. I'm just gonna buy uh, two other ones and send them out. I'm yeah. just teasing you. <laughs> yeah. So I ran out of the lalik. This is I couldn't show it because I don't have any more lalik. So I oh, I right. gave my lalik. I had 27 yeah. bottles of the lalik, and then uh, I gave all of them out. Oh my god! So yeah, I don't have any more left. So now I have I can. These I think these are as good as the Lalique one. These are I mean this these ones are really good. You guys should look at the notes for those, and they're not expensive at all. Yeah, you guys should really look at uh, the name. Look at the notes for this perfume. Uh, it's uh, Ambre Doria by uh, Exuma E X U M A Exuma Pro, uh, Perfume. E it's really good. Huh? I'm writing, I'm looking it up on Fragrantica right now. Hold it up. Yeah. Uh-huh. A-M, you want me to write it, to type it? Let me type it for you guys. Oh, Marsha said Jessica Simpson. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> no, Marsha. <laughs> no, it's not Jessica Simpson. Simpson. I'm, I'm, typing, I'm typing the name of the perfume for you guys. The one I'm giving away. Oh, it zooms your scent of the scent of the night, Rock and Robin. That's awesome. Huh? Uh, Rock and Robin says that's her scent of the night. Oh, uh, that's her scent of the night. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, really? That's what she said. Okay. Yeah, it's it's a it's a gorgeous perfume. Uh, it's not Killian. So, uh, good night, Belinda. Good night. Thank you for coming. Uh, which one do you guys think it is? Anybody? Uh, it's uh, you know we, you know you know was talking about it. It was uh, Amina. Amina pulled the perfume. She had two of the same perfume out, and she pulled it out, and then we're giving a hard time. The, uh, Nobody made it through the four-hour marathon. Mm -hmm. Fahima said uh, Inicio. No, it's not Inicio. Uh, Nat said something with vanilla. Uh, yes, hit the like. We only have yes. two likes so far. There's 51. Hey, would you from this mix? Hey, thank you for being here. Oh my you God, we have 51 people. We're, about we're about to be done. And we have 51 people here. That's amazing. Thank you for coming, guys. Thank everyone for coming. And Thank you so much. Like or subscribe. Oh, it's a long one. Yeah, so uh, Six Rock and Robin said, Rose, that's the perfume of WhatsApp burn I was telling you about the other night. Remember? Yes. And because of you, I went and bought it, and I love it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I want to buy the perfume because you mentioned it, and then I love it. It's, it's great. So please tell them how great it is. Joanne said it's not a Mancera. Who, yep, Frederick Mal. It is Frederick Mal. Oh yeah. my gosh. Oh, yeah. Yep, here they are. She bought two by accident? Huh? You're saying she Lulu. bought two by accident? Yeah, so Lulu got the, uh, the uh, Umbra Doria. Yay! Yeah, congratulations, congratulations, Lulu. Congratulations, Lulu. If you don't want it, you can give it to somebody else. And guys, please, please remember to send me your address, please. Uh, either you send it to me uh, to uh, 
email and then uh oh you send it to me to uh oh my god she says she's all doing in code but she'll pay for shipment oh my god kuwait might be hard uh, lulu i'm not leaving the house uh for a very for a long time so i cannot even go to the post office to ship it to you in kuwait uh they will not pick up international shipping shipment uh they will pick up a shipment from my house but they will not pick up international shipment I'm sorry, girlfriend. Yeah, uh, I, I, can, I, can get, I can send you something, uh, something else from Fragrance X and Fragrance Net because they do ship uh, overseas. But it will take you forever to get it. And then where I buy this, they don't have it at Fragrance X and Fragrance Net, so you cannot. Uh, I cannot ship it to you from there. Uh, yeah, I know. I know you say you pay for ship for shipment, but I'm not leaving the house because of COVID. So I cannot go to the post. I'm not. I'm, I don't even want to go to the post office, and I don't even think it's worth paying for ship paying for shipment. But I can send you something else from Fragrance Net. Email me. I can get send you get you another perfume, and I promise I will get you another perfume that I can. Because if I can buy from Fragrance Net or Fragrance X, they do ship out of the country. Uh, and so I I will send you something else. Okay, I'm I'm so sorry. I apologize. Sorry, Lulu, we didn't know. Yeah, because of COVID, I'm not, I'm not living home. And, you know, unfortunately, the state that I am in, I'm, where I'm staying now, I'm living, it's, uh, we have a lot of cases, so I need to protect myself. And moreover, you know, protect my niece who's with me, my 14-year-old niece, because I don't want to catch anything and bring it to her. Yeah. So uh, that one I had to order for Maddie from Israel. Oh, your mom ordered a perfume for you from Israel? This one? Oh, wow. Yeah, sorry, you know, I, I'm putting a note here. You're gonna email me and then I'll, uh, I'll get you something else, okay? Now, I'm now I, feel, I feel like crap now for not, well, for, not telling, for not saying it. You just need to make it clear at the beginning of every giveaway that people are expected to have a U.S. postal service that yeah. postal address or you know, uh, yeah. uh, some, yeah. somewhere they can post in the state. Yeah, COVID is really, really bad in my state now. And I don't even go to the post office. Mm -hmm. uh, I have, so, you know, when I have to go to, to pick up my mail, my mail, I have someone who goes and, and, and picks, picks them up for me. So I don't, because I don't want to leave. Yeah. Bye, Michelle. Uh, already, my phone is dying. Okay. Bye. Bye, Michelle. Thank you so much for being here, Michelle. Thank really appreciate it. Uh, all right. So, I can show two more perfumes so to give someone a chance to win that other perfume since I cannot send it to uh uh since I cannot send it to uh to uh Lulu where she is. But Lulu, I will send you another perfume. I I, I can get you something else, anything that fragrance net and fragrance S X sells that is within that price range, I will get it to you. We uh just message me and then we'll we'll, we'll communicate their uh their message. You can you can call me via uh directly from Instagram, right? Yeah, if you have any family in the states here, Lulu, I can send it to them for you, and then they can send it. They can send it to you, and I've done that before. So yeah. find find an address in the state, and I will send it to that person, and that person will be responsible to get it to you. Okay, all right. Okay, so do you have another perfume, Mari? Sure. Did I don't remember who just went. You went. I want, yes. So uh, this will, well, I can do this fragrance, which is another one of my signatures. So when I was worried that Thank you, patchouli, William. Bye. Thank you for coming, William. Um, when I was worried the patchouli was going away, um, I, <laughs> yeah, she's watched all over the world. Um, yes, I can tell that for baby. And I found Eau Durand, which is like one of my favorite gift teeth. Okay, hold on a second, Maddie. Hold on a second, Maddie. So Lulu, yeah. tell you what, sweetheart. Uh, I'm going to hold on to that perfume. I'm going to send you something else from uh, uh, Fragrance X or Fragrance Net, another perfume, and I'm going to hold on to that for you. After COVID is over, I will get it to you. Okay, I will go and mail it to you after COVID is over. When I'm when I'm able to go out. And when I, I feel safe to go out, because right now 
as much as I love my subscribers, I love people who, who come to my shows, I cannot put myself in any kind of danger to ship something out. I wouldn't even do it for my mother right now. I would not go out, out right now because I'm, I decided to stay home. Uh, so, but I will hold on to the perfume and then after, after things are safe, I will go to the post office and get it to you. And, but I'm going to send you something directly from fragrance net or fragrance X and I promise. All right. Okay. Maddie. Diptyque. Charlie. Diptyque. Oh. I don't have any diptyque yet. You do. I need it's one. It's on its way. It's on its way in a little package coming to you. Oh. Which one is this one? ODL. ODL, okay. I need to try, I need to try that, that ODL. It's coming. It's on its way. Um, so this one. Oh, check I, this out. Check this out. Oh my gosh, you're moving to Palestine, Ruth and Robin? Wow. No, she, told me, she told me that the other day and I was, I was heartbroken. I'm like, oh my gosh, she's moving away. We'll miss you, but come on. <laughs> We can still chat. <laughs> um, yes, Joanne, I love the tea too. Not everyone loves it. Um, like it and tell why you don't like it and why you don't so she can well, no, because No, no, it's, it's talking about the likes. If, if people are pushing, are not pushing the like buttons. Oh, yes, please, yeah. please like. We, do we have likes? I have 21. <laughs> I have 21. That's good. Good. Yeah, um, I have 21. Okay. So, um, diptyque, yeah, Audrey. It it's vanilla. Um, it has some pink peppercorn, which gives a little bit of pickles, a little bit of spice, and it's just really, I feel, a unique fragrance. Um, I know I brought a lot of vanilla and a lot of warmth to the table tonight. This is one of my favorites. Um, it, uh, I just feel unique. Um, and I know you need to spray it, but um, this is what I spray and walk through instead of multiple spritzes. And I've laid, uh, Lula said they, she had layered the, um, the patchouli with something. I've layered the patchouli with a different diptyque, uh, the 30, 34 Saint-Germain. This one holds its own just fine. So it has uh, aromatic, vanilla, fresh, spicy, warm, spicy, balsamic, amber, woody, soft, spicy, and sweet. And it is sweeter than most of what I presented tonight. So, um, oh, you still haven't tried the dread? What'd you get? Um, this one? Uh, it must be, oh. Wow. Well, anyway. I don't, I, have, any, I don't have any diptych. Uh, I was planning on getting the uh, the the Ooh. patchouli one. No, the not the patchouli one. The uh, mm. something wood. Yeah. Wood something. Well, wood palau. Yeah. Wood palau. See, see how you yeah, like I, it. Because okay. I sent I sent you some. See if you like it. Because it's a good vanilla. Okay. It's a good vanilla. All right. Okay. Uh oh, it's a vanilla. Yeah. Why didn't you tell me that the whole time? I would have had it already if it's a vanilla. You don't listen. You never listen. <laughs> okay. All right. I'm going to make this really easy for people. What is this perfume? I talked about it the other day. I'm just showing you the back of it. Who makes this perfume? Hey, Fafa. Who makes Fafa. this perfume, guys? Right? What is this perfume? I talked about it the other day in my life. And Lulu gave me gave me gave me hell for it because I did not tell her that I was going to buy it. Not oh, this I Lulu, no, the other Lulu. No. Huh? Okay, who won first? Uh Joanne is the first winner, and then Chrissy O oh, is the second one, and then Uncommon is the third one. Yep. Okay. Uh she, she said just tell us. <laughs> uh, Christy said it's a tuberose one. So Joanne is the first winner. So Joanne, you'll get a bottle of uh, this one. If you want to donate to somebody, let me know. You know, Joanne said uh, I send her mail every week. <laughs> and she's right. Wow, well, Maude, that's right. intense. <laughs> huh? I'm just reading what Maude said. 
Oh my God! Guess what? I, guess what I was writing? I was writing joins them down, and I put Ember Loop next to it instead of, of instead of the uh, this other. She will end up with this one. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Lulu, Lulu Q8, please email me tonight. Please uh, email me or send me a message on uh, uh, WhatsApp and on, on uh, Instagram. Send me your address. I'm gonna get something out to you. I yeah, please send me your address and do not tell me you're not gonna send me your address. Please send me your address, okay? Uh, oh, you receive your barrel uh uh, uh chair. Thank God, finally. Oh, this thing is off my shoulder finally the, he went to like oh my god so i sent him a bottle of perfume the first one that I, I got him the wrong one to begin with then i got him a second one the second one came with book he was doing a video and then he was doing an unboxing and then when he opened it it broke <laughs> doing the video and i was laughing and so i emailed the company and i said look he was doing a video, he was talking so well about, you know, your package and everything and the perfume book. And I sent him the link to the video and they reply and said, we're gonna send, we're gonna send him a replacement. Mm -hmm. Instead of them sending the replacement to him, they send it to me. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, so I, had to get, I had to go, you know, and mail it to him, yeah. Thank you, thank you, uh, 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 Nat, Nat said I'm a godsend. I don't know if I'm a godsend, uh, but you I know are, I wasn't, I wasn't sent by the devil. To many people you are. Uh, so, uh, Exuma, she gets to Umbridoria. Okay, Umbridoria. All right. Do you have any more perfume to show, Maddie? I'm gonna share, show one more and then after that we can call it a night because it's 9 30. We still have 43 people here. Unless okay. you guys want to hang out with you know, around and talk about some more stuff. One uh, thing you show and then you'll be done. Oh my yeah. God. You guys know what happened to me today? Oh, I didn't tell you, Maddie. So uh, I said I was gonna, uh, you know, uh, go to a drive thru and get some food for my niece because I really didn't want to cook. So I'm like, you know, going to a drive thru is safe, right? Because you're in your car, you wear your mask, you just order the food, and then you just put your hand out with your gloves and you get you you, you grab the food. So and then I placed the order, and as I'm, I'm I drove up, and then my my niece likes Pepsi, so I we don't we don't I don't keep anything like that around the house because all I have out in my house is. You know tea and then water because we don't drink any pop or anything like that and so they gave me the, the food I, I took the back put it in my car and the young lady was i asked for pepsi because my niece likes pepsi so I, you know even though and then i will give, you know give her a can of pepsi the young lady was pouring the pepsi uh guess what she, she, she what happened she had no mask in her face okay and then she had the sniffles she was going like this Ooh. And no and matter, said, they're just snotting everywhere. I know. And I said to her, can you please put a mask on? She's like, what? I said, put a mask on. And then she handed me the Pepsi. She said, she, she didn't say she handed me. She said, I said, you know what? Keep it. Keep the Pepsi. I don't want it. No. Nope. And then I uh and then I left. And then you know, as I was leaving, I said to myself, you know what? No, I'm gonna go back. I went back and I said, I want to speak with a supervisor. And uh, and I told the supervisor, I said, you know what? I want my money back for the Pepsi. Yeah. Thank you, thank you, Osman. Yeah, I said, I want my money back. And you know, she, uh, the girl said, so you want a dollar? I said, sweetheart, I don't care if it's 50 cents. You yeah. are you know, serving food in, during a, you know, a pandemic, right? A public health emergency. Yeah. People are getting sick, especially here. And now you are working inside of a food establishment with a young man next to you and you don't have your mask on. Your mask is right under your nose. So yes, I want my money back. So the manager came and gave me, it was like 2 cents, you know, uh, for the, I said, I just took my money and said, thank you. And he's like, do you want the Pepsi? I said, uh, no. No, they were no. No. no, yeah, I don't want it. Yeah, no. yeah. yeah. And you, I should, I should actually report them. I should actually call the toll phone number and report them because, you know, this is why this, this, this is still here because people are not doing their part to, you know, to make sure to make sure that people are, are protected. Well, people are getting very lax too. You know, they're yeah. getting tired and they're getting 
um, lazy about wearing their mask. Yeah, and, and that's, that's, how I was, that's how I was really was on the phone with me. She was on the phone with me when, when all of this happened. So she can vouch, vouch that I'm not making this up. Yep. Yeah. And I was like, I said, she, you know, she's, I mean, she had the sniffles. You, I could hear her. Right. And then pouring this, you know, this Pepsi, uh, for, you know, for, for my niece. I'm like, you are not going to cause my niece to get sick. You know, she is with me. I'm responsible for, her. I'm like a parent to her now. You're not going to cause her to get sick and for me to get sick. No, well, and you're, the, you're the breadwinner for the home. If you get sick, what are you going to do? You know, I mean, it's for not, a lot of people, it's, they it's, not, it's, it's not come up being the breadwinner. So, okay, let's just say if I wasn't working, you know, I didn't have any money to pay, to you know, to pay for food or anything like that. All of my sisters, my brother, my friends, people would, would pitch in. But my mother, I cannot be sick because of my mom. Because if I get sick, I either get better or I die, right? If I die, I'm going to leave my mom. And I want to be the person to bury my mom. I don't want my mom to bury me. Not that I want my mom to die, but I want to be there for her and I want to be here for my family. So anything I can do to protect myself and protect others, I'm going to do it. Yeah. And you know, like uh, Robert said, it's the principle. Yeah. She was sniffing. She shouldn't even be working. She should be at home. She shouldn't yeah. even be working, especially in the food, food establishment. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, yeah, give me my money back. I left and I told her, I'm like, no, 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 I'm going back. <laughs> I'm going back. I want my money. <laughs> yeah. So, oh, my son said, uh, oh, no, that was, I hope she was. Taking her mask down to smell your breath. No, <laughs> that's very funny. I was in sight because I would. There was no. I would have gone. In, I would go inside of a restaurant right now. No, I'm not going inside of a restaurant. No, I have my groceries delivered. So, you guys, my last perfume for the night. Well, I'm gonna show two because we're talking about yummy perfumes, right? Yummy. Oh, what did you? You are next, right, Maddie? No, go ahead. Oh, okay. So this one. This is. Uh what is this? Oh my god. Uh, what is this? A girl, oh more girl uh, intense. This is the intense one. Uh I love more girl, don't get me wrong, but the intense version is so good, you guys. Oh, it's sweet, it's sweet, it's beautiful. And this could be like you know a Christmas uh, uh Christmas perfume as well. It's really, really nice. Yeah. Listen to what she said. I was I want my money back. Even if it's a dollar, then give it back to me. I was sure I was like, I'm like, yeah. Even if it's a dollar, give it back to me. Yeah. Uh, this is sweet. Have you ever smelled more girl? Uh, 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 Maddie? Um, I think so. I don't. I don't know for sure. I don't recall. Uh, Chrissy said, is this uh, the intense less lavender? Yes, it's, it has less lavender. It's, it's very sweet. Yeah, this is a sweet, uh, and you know, it's hard to find. The intense one is kind of hard to find. Okay. Yeah, but it's, it's a beautiful, it's a uh, very uh, gorgeous perfume. And the last one is this one. Uh, okay, what's, what's the name? Oh my God. Do you guys know what this one is? This one is, it's, uh, it's as the okay, Alafoli, New Alafoli, something New Alafoli. Um, I've seen that one a lot lately. Lacom, Lacom, uh, Alafoli, something. Lacom, La New Alafoli. That's Lacom. Okay, okay. Oh, this one is very. I mean, that's what I'm wearing tonight. It's very sweet, very beautiful, uh, uh fragrance. Yes, yeah, so so Christy gets guessed it. Yep, La Trésor, Trésor, yeah, Trésor, La Nuit à la Folie. Uh, so what does that one smell like? Is it oh, sweet? Is oh it my God. Like? It, you, look it up. Uh, please look at the note. It, yeah, it's, uh, okay, so Nadia said, yep, uh, La Nuit à la Folie. So it's, you know, it's very affordable. Uh, like, probably, I think I maybe pay, pay maybe like 50 something dollars for it, for the big bottle. Okay, so uh, Nina, Nina said, 
Oh. Vanilla, amber, sweet, fruity, soft, spicy, rose, fresh, warm, spicy, floral, and powdery. Yep. It's an oriental vanilla fragrance. Oh, it is. Yeah, it, it's, it's a really good, uh, beautiful perfume. Yeah, it's nice. You, uh, I think, you know, this is something you would like also. No, I don't think you would like this one, Maddie, because you you like more more exotic. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I, I don't know that I'd like the rose in it. Uh, you, yeah, you probably would like it because you're more, you, you're more like, uh, uh, not, not fully, not fully type of person. Right. right. Uh, Nadia said, do you think it's worth the money? Yes, Nadia, if you don't pay full price for it, I wouldn't pay for the, you know, the hefty full price. Yeah. No, because you can get it at the discounters. You can get it at Fragrance X or Fragrance Net right. for less and even Fragrance Buy for less the money. Uh, but I would, yeah, I think it's worth it. Yeah, I think it's worth the money. Yeah, it's, yeah. It, this could be a signature scent. This yeah. could be a signature scent. Yeah, it's it's good enough to be a signature scent, guys. But and look at even the bottle is beautiful. Beautiful bottle, yeah. Yeah, beautiful bottle, beautiful, you know, beautiful perfume. And I don't have anything to see it on. I think it might be probably have something to see it on. Yeah, I do. Of course, yep. Yeah. All right, you guys have any questions for us? Oh, uh, I have one more thing to show. One more thing. Um, did, you, did you have a giveaway? Me? Yes, you said you had something to give. I gave it away. No, I do. But before that, this is not a giveaway. This okay. Is, so, in conclusion of the red bottles, I'm I'm opening this box, and this was a freebie with the red bottles. Oh, really? Hard to get. It was hard to get, and um, this is what you get. This is the Christmas uh, snow globe. You get purchase of a movie world wow um fragrance so they're sold out you can't get them anymore but this was my really? purchase yeah they don't have any more so this is exciting but to people who can't wear perfume i guess um anyway i love it i'm excited um oh what's the best vanilla perfume we have in our collection Ooh, that's, oh, this is, that's cloth that's not fair <laughs> that's a tough one uh oh my god so oh i don't know that i'm not i'm gonna refrain from answering because i like okay, i have why don't, you take this, why don't you take this one Mari? Uh, let, let's see what you have let's see oh, what you want to i just said i'm gonna refrain from answering and then you put me on the spot uh, oh come on <laughs> help me out new girlfriend uh Oh wait, who wants me to remove what? Someone said remove the lead. Let's okay, so if I if I say you you are one of my best one of my besties, will you do it? No, I am one of your besties. I'm still not gonna do it <laughs> <laughs> because I love you and I am your bestie. But but um. She, I, someone has to remove the lead from your thing. Or five vanillas in front of me. And I can't pick one. I can't. Um, I, I have a problem with commitment. I can't commit. So what's yours, Rose? Okay. All right. So right now I have two. Well, I, I wouldn't call this the best vanilla. But if you guys want to find out what the, to me, the best vanilla fragrance that I have in my collection is probably uh Annie Shin. And I have Hi, one. Oh wait, 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 wait. I forgot about this one. <clears throat> so okay. I should go down right. my oh ah, ha, ha, ha. is that what I had out? No, oh, no. no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I still don't have that one. <laughs> yeah, that's the best one. Okay. Okay. So you have first, I have second. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Fair enough. Good vanilla. It's the best vanilla I have in my collection. Look, I've, uh, look, I've, I've, I've given it away so much. Look, you see, no more. 
Yeah, that's the best. I think that's the best vanilla perfume that I have in my collection, guys. Lulu, which uh, which bottle are you talking about? I don't know which one you're talking about. I think she's talking about your thing. Uh, uh, the Snowbo? Yes. Uh, Facebook user said, is it not, not Vani? Yes, it's not Vani. Not, not Vani. Oh. Uh, yeah, I think, I think it's discontinued. Oh, no, I'll never have it. I'll never own it for my very own. No, but you... <laughs> stop, stop it. I think you can find it at... Uh, she said the previous red one, Maddie. I think you can find it at uh, what's that place? Uh, Lucky Scent. Try okay. Lucky Scent. Okay. Uh, so I think, um, I, Lulu, I think there was some confusion. I, I have two red bottles and a snow globe. This, this one is just a snow globe. It doesn't have to be. It's just a decoration. It doesn't open. Um, the other two, Luby Rouge. And this one's cap open, and then um, Luby Croc that everyone's afraid of. This one's cap open. Okay, so Facebook user said it's not this discontinued. It's unlucky. Sent for two hundred and twenty-five dollars. Sweet, it shall be mine. I'm so, not gonna buy it tonight. Huh? What'd you say? So this is this is a boozy vanilla, guys. It's a little boozy because it has some warm in it, but it's awesome. really, it's really sexy, really, really good. Okay, so I have something to give away, but okay, I don't know. oh, okay, let's see. A little something. Hold on, bear with me. I'll be uh, right back. Well, let's say which one is this one. So let me type the name for you, Gillian. It's not M Mikalef. So it's not. So it's N O T E Vanille. By Michael M. That M. I. C. A. L. L. E. F. It's this one. Gotta make sure I have what I'm promising. Okay. So bear with me a moment, because I've got all sorts of little stuff here. Okay, so, drum roll please. I don't have a lot to give, but I have a little to give. Um, how about, what, how do you want to play the game? I'll let you have the game, Rose. Uh, what are you giving away first? Nothing big. <laughs> okay. okay. So you want to do a game? Huh? It's you want just to do a little sample. Uh, two, well, three, three samples. They're like one or two ounces, and um, and another. So four samples. <laughs> four samples. <laughs> okay. You're gonna put them put them in one just one thing, right? One package. Yep. And let's okay. Let me say what we've got, and you can decide. I have. In I have a oh that sounds good Nirvana from Elizabeth yeah, yeah. Elizabeth they make, they make good good perfume oh wait wait I have something else to give away okay then you give away <laughs> no 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 you, no go go ahead uh, I can do it tomorrow I can do it tomorrow because uh, hey, you guys uh comment on comment sense and I will be live to tomorrow what time are we gonna be live tomorrow on comment because I haven't even create create the the post yet hi Leah Baker. Thanks for being here. Uh, thank you, New. I've never seen you here before. Thanks for coming. Thanks for being here. Yeah. You know, uh, well, yeah. uh, we're going to be on tomorrow uh, at uh, maybe 7.30 or 8. I don't know what time. Uh, but uh, please join us tomorrow. Uh, I have one a little something to give away. It's nothing big, but I'll, I'll give something away tomorrow. I mean, you guys wanna gonna come here to see me anyway, to to see to spend the time with us, whether whether I have something to give or not, because sometimes I don't give, and then you guys are are, are here also. Oh, Nadia, it's gonna be your birthday tomorrow. Oh, okay, happy birthday, happy early birthday, Nadia. And I think I, don't I have something to send to you? I have something. I owe Nadia something. 
Yeah, she won something last week. Yeah, I think I have her address to get to get something out to you. So happy birthday to you, girlfriend. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Birthdays are wonderful. I celebrate. Yeah. Okay, what are you giving away? Uh, sorry, what are you giving away? Oh my god. Okay. Um so what I can do is three little Killians. How about that? Oh, okay. I, have, I have roses on ice. I have um well, these are not little, these are pretty big. Yeah, they are. So let's separate them. No, no, so give them one give them to one person. Okay, so they are pretty big and they're in cute little Chanel things. So I have roses on ice and uh, angel share, and uh, I could probably do um, one of uh, black phantom too. Oh and wow! Then, and then um, <laughs> a token from Arizona because I'm trying to get rid of these. <laughs> if anybody wants a token from Arizona and a card from me, let me know and. I'll send you some. Okay, so you're going to be three, 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 uh, three Killian. So, three Killian, okay. which is a big deal coming out of my collection, and uh, to a U.S. only address. And I'm sorry, guys, but that's all I can do. So we've got to we've got to figure out a game. Two ones are going to give it to. Uh, okay, so what? Uh, uh, Unique said, give it to the birthday girl. All right, it's done. Give it to Nadia. Okay. Who's Nadia? Yeah, it's your birthday tomorrow. Okay, Nadia, you get them. Where, where, okay. You'll give Rose your information and. Yeah. I think I, I have her address already. Great. Okay. Because I'm, I'm supposed to be sending her something. Uh, okay. Pam wants to know what they are. Well, I, I think we didn't do that fairly, Rose, but if you want to give it to Nadia, that's fine. Um, yeah, or someone, someone said to give it to Nadia. Yeah, you know, you give it to the <laughs> well, someone said um, it's roses on ice and uh, angel share and uh, black phantom. Ooh, angel share. Okay, I want it now. I changed my mind. I'm just joking. I have angel share. Yeah. So, okay, so that's what we're doing. Angel share, roses on ice, black phantom, and in Arizona. So um, I haven't smelled uh, roses on ice yet, but uh, angel share is really good and black phantom is really good. Okay. Well. <laughs> well, sorry, Pam. We didn't play the game. Oh uh, well, okay. So, uh, someone someone just asked me a question. If I ever if I ever try uh, the decan she sent me, uh, no, I'm I want to try them when I have money because I don't want to end up buying all of them. But let me show you guys what what Erin sent me. She, she did not send me a decan. She sent me like fifty thousand barrels. Christy, um, I was not a huge fan of Roses on Ice only because it was very cucumber forward to me and I'm not a huge fan of cucumber scent. So for that reason only, it wasn't my favorite. Um, if you like the cucumber, I, it was just very strong on the cucumber to me. So, so let me show you what uh, I received from Deb the other day. From Deborah Day, uh, Deb, what this is, is a uh, private moss first Arabian oil. It's gorgeous. Mm. It's very beautiful. I'm keeping. I'm gonna keep it in the uh, in the box that it's in. It's a beautiful. I mean, that was a beautiful gift to receive. You know, receive from her. It's gorgeous. I'm gonna keep it here. I'm not gonna. You know, this is this is like for special occasion, right? When when I have a boyfriend, one of these days. Uh, I also received 50,000 uh, bottles of the of perfumes from Erin. Oh my God, Erin. Yes. Well, Aaron, and these are not like, these are not like small, small decants. These are like, you know, big, big uh, 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 decants. Uh, these are, I mean, these are the sizes, you know, big decants of uh, perfume she sent me. And I, you know, I, uh, I sniffed a couple, one of the, a couple of them, but I know I'm going to end up loving all of them, so therefore I'm not even going to take my time to uh, t try them now because once I try them, I'm not going to want them. And then, I, you know, I, I need, I cannot be uh, buying all these perfumes at once because last week I went crazy. And this week uh, also, I received so much, so much stuff that, you know, 
was delivered. I got my new iPhone this week, uh, uh, today that came my iPhone 12 Max. I haven't even opened it yet. I got mine, mine's open. I don't yeah, know I didn't open, open mine. It, you know, the UPS guy came, you know what he did? He just threw it in front of the door. I hope it's not broken. Yeah, I hope it's not broken. Uh, but, uh, and I also owe Aaron a bunch of a bunch of uh, uh, Montera Montera uh, uh, Dickens that I promise I'm gonna send to her. Uh, and maybe tonight that's what I'll do. I'll, I'll get you know get her package ready to to send out to her uh, so she can she can have them uh, by by next week. So yeah, so I you know uh, and she you know she did you, she send an amouage? Am I supposed to send you amouage to Aaron? Wait, do I? Am I? Did I have to send you some amouage perfumes to Aaron? Please tell me now. Uh, blast me out because you know I've been a really bad friend because I was supposed to get you those things out to you. It's been two weeks, and you know what I do? Uh, people that I know, uh, I don't when when I have to send things to them, I take my time. But yeah. these people that I really know very well, oh, stop it, buddy. I send the things to them very fast because they don't know me. Those, those people who know me, like Aaron, you, Pam, you guys know that I will get it out to you guys, right? But those other people, I get it to them out quickly because I don't want them to, you know, to have to wait. That's, you know, that's just the way I, I, I think. Okay, so uh, okay, so Aaron, I owe you Mansera and Amuaj. Okay, Aaron, I will send you a tracking number tomorrow, and uh, the the uh, the. Uh, UPS man, when he, uh, the U, the postal office person, when he comes in, he'll pick up your package tomorrow. No, don't say you're not in a rush. Don't say that. Uh -uh. Yeah, don't, don't say that, Aaron. You'll never get it. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, don't say that. Uh, yeah, so uh, I have 20. Is it 20 Manceras? So I'm going to get her 20, 20 uh, things of Manceras. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. 14, 16, 18. I have 18 months. 18 or, yeah, 18 months. And then I have how many, uh, amouage? I think five or six, five, maybe? Five amouages. Okay. The amouage, Aaron, they will be, uh, testers because they're, they're small. But the, uh, Manceras, they will be Dickens. I will send you Dickens of, of the Mancera. Hoping that I have 20, uh, 20 something, uh, Dickens of Mancera. To decant all of them, otherwise you'll get two different packages. I apologize. I should have sent it to you. You, you know, you you've been waiting for a very long time. She said, "Oh, geez, <laughs> you asked for it, girl. <laughs> yeah, you asked for it. So now you're gonna have to sit home and smell all of them. All right. Well, we've been here for two hours, guys. I think this was a really, really good life. It was awesome. Thank, thank you, you so much. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you, uh, uh, Miley. Uh, thank you so much, guys, for spending the time with us tonight. For you know, uh, opening your home to us to you know while you at home cooking, doing other things, and listening to us. Uh, and oh boy, someone said, "Oh shit." <laughs> uh, and I really appreciate it. And Pam said, "I need you to send me all your Mansara that was perfume corner." I won't ask for an entire cabinet, not yet. Do you want uh, the all the bottles, or do you want me to give you the names? Yeah, you get the names, but not samples of all the bottles, because she kind of goes crazy when people ask her that. <laughs> <laughs> That's verboten. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Deborah. Thank you. Thank you so thank much. You yeah, thank you. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Thank yeah, you. it was really nice, guys. And please be safe. And I'll be on tomorrow. So this is a really long week for me, weekend for me. I'll be on tomorrow with Uncommon Sense. I'll be on Friday with uh, with Pam. And I'm sure Pam is going to have some goodies to give away to. And then I will also be uh, on Sunday. I'm going to put out a video uh, of my new perfume that I have. And on Saturday, I'm going to try to do my uh, live with my uh, all of my uh, my perfume, entire perfume, perfume uh, uh, collection for three. And then there will be some, also I will be giving away some some freebies uh, during that that live because I said during the live I'm gonna give a test of all, all of the perfume that I show uh, for every live during my uh, uh, collection my, when I do my collection my perfume collection. So I'm looking forward to seeing you guys and 
and chat with you on tomorrow night, Friday, Saturday, and then for you guys to watch my video on Sunday. Yes, I know. She said that's a lot. I know that's that that's a long weekend. That is gonna be a very long weekend. Uh, but I will be able to rest, you know, uh, on Thursday is a holiday. I don't have to work. I've been working from home because I'm afraid of, you know, going anywhere. But uh, it will be fun. Thank you so much. Good and then, thank you. Thank you so much, Maddie, for being here with me. I really appreciate it. Uh, I you. love you. you guys with me. I wish you would be, you know, have your own YouTube channel, but you don't. But I'm just going to have to take, you know, to take take advantage of you when you come to the lives and, and work with me. So good night, oh. everyone. And be safe. And be good. Mwah.